Hey guys, how are we doing? So I've realised that I haven't done an actual watch me stick my stickers in video in a while. So I thought I would talk as I do this this week. Um, I'm going to show you my daily as well as my weekly. So I'm doing, I'm still a couple of weeks ahead, which is great. And this is definitely how I need to plan. Because even though I haven't wrote anything on next week's spread yet, I just feel way more comfortable knowing that it's it's already done. Um, I'm using my medium planner so much during lockdown. And if you remember from a few videos ago, I really struggled. I was just, I tried to do something different. I tried to like put my homeschooling stuff in there and tried to create all these new schedules. And actually that's when you enter this crazy, crazy time, what you need to be doing is not creating more work for yourself. So the last two weeks, I want to say, I will go back and check, but the last two weeks I've gone back and I've just planned how I always plan. And you know what? It's been, it's been amazing. Like I feel completely, I'm going to say feel on top of stuff. Um, I guess I do in a way feel on top of stuff. I feel like I know what I have to do. Whether it gets done or not is probably a whole different story. But it is definitely keeping me sane. So I'm using my medium planner as like a day-to-day -day write stuff down that needs to be done. All these kids' Zoom calls and activities they need to do from school. Um, but it's just, I'm not writing homeschooling charts down. And I'm writing like, areas of the house... I would like to clean, not gonna lie, no deep cleaning has actually happened um, <laughs> since lockdown has started. But this week I'm hopeful I'm gonna clear out my cart because I've seen some videos from the Mama Makes store on Instagram about doing some like journaling cards and stuff. And I feel really inspired, like I need to, I need to make something. But I need to shop my own stash at the minute before I go purchase all her beautiful papers. Um, I also need to work out what I'm actually going to make. But that's a whole different story, isn't it? I've also found out something. Let me go back to this week's spread. So in our Fibre Friday kits, which let me get... There's a cactus one this week that you missed out on now. It's gone. But this week's was cactus theme. And... Um, you get these little washi strips in our Fiverr Fiver, Fiver Friday deal and they are great. Like I've used them so much in this spread for like on the tops and breaking up lines and down the side. And I've not done that before, but I am super looking forward to using them in, um, in this week's as well. So this kit actually... Like, I'm so proud to myself. So this is one of our whips kits that didn't cut right, but I'm still, I'm still willing to use it for myself. So I've also got next week's kit already planned. I'm feeling really organised. We do have a load of new kits on the website. And always, if you want to see something, if you have a certain thing in mind that you want and you can't find, drop me a message. I'm not promising I'll do it, but sometimes it's nice to be a little bit inspired. So what else is new? We have launched our download. Um, yeah, our download part of the website. So it's mainly um, a lot of lettering. Again, like I'm just finding my style and working out what I want to do. Um, but there is a lot. Well, there isn't a lot. There's a few. I made it sound like there was loads. It's it's a lot more time consuming than I thought it was. And I've realised I'm actually a little bit precious about what I do and what I want to sell and what I don't want to sell. Because my iPad is literally full of drawings. Um, but yeah, turns out I'm quite protected over a few of them as I've come to try and like list them. I'm like, oh, no, I don't want to. <laughs> but there is some lettering on there. One of my favourites is in this week's spread as well. Let me just get that one there and then I'll show you. So this Rosa Hallelujah, um, you can get the clip art. It comes in 
I want to say four different colours, but that is available on the download part of the website now. I can't even remember what else is on there, but there's some stuff. And I actually quite enjoy doing it. It's made me like drawing again. Because I feel like all I do at the minute is draw the gonks, which I love, but it's not as creative as maybe I once was. Yeah, so it's good. I'm going to try and do one a week. Like, no promises again, because life is just crazy, isn't it? Like, there's three kids at home, I'm working full-time, and works full-time. Life is busy. But I feel like if I'm drawing, then the kids will draw as well. And then, you know, I can pretend like that's part of our homeschooling thing, and we've done art for the day. <laughs> How is homeschooling going for the people that are homeschooling? I have realised I'm not a teacher. By any any means like that is not my forte at all hats off to anyone who is a teacher because like i love my kids so much but whew, teaching them is hard and it's like it's even it's stuff i know do you know what i mean like so my kids are young so we're doing like times tables and phonics and stuff that's quite fun but they keep on asking me questions and I'm just like, I don't, I don't know. Like, why is this this? I don't know. It, it just, it just is kids. Like, laws of the land. It's fun. I've also found out my nine-year-old knows way more than I do. Like, she is so, she's really academic. So she's just pretty much teaching herself stuff. Um, <laughs> but... Yeah, she comes to me and she asks me about like verbs and adjectives and I'm like, let me just check Google and see. Like slyly looking, like, oh, hang on, Nana's just messaged me, let me reply and find the answer all at the same time. Yeah, it's, it's eye-opening. But it's, it's good fun, like, it is, it's nice to spend all this extra time with them. We've been on some lovely walks as well, which is definitely, that's how we do our lessons at the minute. Like we go on walks, everybody counts something different. And then there's like, who's got the most? It's, that's how I'm teaching maths. The internet is teaching them French quite well, actually. I'm making them write stuff down. We've done, we've done a lot of hands-on learning, like people are cooking. <laughs> I'm teaching them how to clean a lot as well, which someone said I was really mean for because every day ooh, these kids have to do some kind of chore just because they're here all the time now. So they're just making stuff dirty all the time. But I don't think it's me. These guys need to tidy. <gasps> so this is this week. Um, as I was saying, yeah, by the Friday this week was cactuses so i will be using these loads in the spread i'm gonna bob all these up here and fill it in oh let me just show you my daily as well i'm absolutely loving the daily at the minute so this is one of my fave ones um it's just so therapeutic like i'm finding it such a good coping mechanism and i've just ordered four more for, from the um, Passion Planner website. So I have committed to another year of this. I mean, I suppose I haven't, but I feel like it costs enough money that I actually, I definitely have. But this kit is one of my favorites. So this kit is, this kit corresponds with this one, which is next week's. So it's gonna match. I'm very, very excited about that. But yeah, so now I'm gonna sit down and have 10 minutes to myself and start to prep next week and think about what I need to do. Let me, I knew I wanted to say something else. I don't use the monthlies in here at all. And I keep on, like, people will keep on saying that this is really, really useful. Um, I've not even read it. I'm not going to lie. I've not even read these pages. But just a quick on how I am using this. So I kind of use it like a bullet journal. So if you look down, I write all the things I have to do and draw little check boxes, um, like Zoom videos. I'm like, what is this? 
<laughs> I'm looking around, I'm like, oh no, it's just a to-do one is this one. But there is a couple of things. Take the meatballs out of the freezer, very, very important. Um, yeah, so to-dos go down. I've used some arrows and stuff for the Zoom things. But yeah, I'm loving it. This is probably my favourite, favourite spread so far. Because it's beautiful, it's bright, it's bold. But most of all, it's actually been really, really functional. Like, this has been the most productive week so far in lockdown. And it's just amazing to think, look how far I've come. Like, I think this was... This was when we found out about lockdown and yeah, it went, it went to pot. This week I did in another planner because I started and was just like, mm -mm, no. Still, was still struggling in lockdown, not really getting there. And then just went back to how I normally plan. And it's been really, really, that slammed really hard, really good for the past. Oh my goodness. How long have we been in lockdown? That is crazy. But yeah, I'm back on track. So let me know what you think. Let me know if there's any themes you want to see. And stay safe, guys. See you later.